everyone, welcome back to TJ's Tech Corner. In today's video, we will be looking at McAfee File Lock. McAfee File Lock is a program that lets you keep your files in a safe that's password protected. So people who use your computer cannot see the files unless they know the password. Alright, let's jump right in. To open McAfee File Lock, go to the File Explorer. Then, click on this PC. Then, if you have McAfee File Lock installed, cl click two times in a row on McAfee Vault. To create a vault, click on Create. Then, enter its name up here, and then drag the slider to change its size. You can choose from 50 megabytes, 100 megabytes, 250 megabytes, 500 megabytes, 1 gigabyte, 1.5 gigabytes, 2 gigabytes, 3 gigabytes, and 4 gigabytes. If you need a bigger vault, click on Advanced Settings. And then you can choose a custom vault size. I don't recommend creating big vaults on your computer if you're low on space. Because, of course, vaults take up space on your hard drive. A document or a spreadsheet is around 2 to 4 megabytes. A picture or song is around 5 to 7 megabytes. A full-length movie is around 750 megabytes. 1,000 megabytes is 1 gigabyte. So if you have a vault that's 4 gigabytes, that's really 4,000 megabytes. To check a file size of a file, go to the File Explorer, then navigate to that file, right-click on it, then click on Properties. And the file size will be right here. This file is 92.6 kilobytes. Back to creating the vault. After creating a name and choosing the vault size, you need to create a password. McAfee will let you know how strong your password is. After you're done, re-enter your password down here. If you forget your password, this is where the next step comes in. Enter your email here. Then, McAfee can send you an email in case you forget your password. Then, they'll let you know how to reset it. Earlier, I created a vault to show you some of the features McAfee File Lock can do. To unlock your vault, click on the vault. Then, click on Unlock. If you forget your password, click on Forgot Your Password. After unlocking your vault, click lock to lock it again. By default, the, the safe will only lock if you click on the lock button, and it won't lock automatically. To make it lock automatically, click on options. Then, check this first box. In this box, type in how many minutes you want your safe to lock after not using it. Check this box if you want your safe to lock when your screensaver is active. That's it for today. Please leave a like if comment if you have any questions. Also like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell icon. See you Monday on TJ's Tech Corner. Bye!